Okay, here we go with a reading of one of the greatest books in English literature. Cat Problems by Jory John, illustrated by Lane Smith. Could be Lani Smith, I don't know, but let's call her Lane Smith. All right, here we go. Cat Problems. Scratch, 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 scratch. Someone's been scratching already. All right, let's go. This table's a bit wobbly. Apologies now for the wobbly table, but hey. All right, there we have the interactory page. And here we go with... Where's that sunbeam? See the sunbeam coming down? Where's that sunbeam going? Hey, sunbeam, get back here. Great, now I'm wide awake and I only got 19 hours of sleep. Sigh. <laughs> it's funny, right? This, this cat is a funny cat. All right, bumpy table again. Here we go on this page. Oh, a few old kernels of dry food. Wonderful. Thanks for remembering, folks. What, <laughs> a, what does it take to get a little bowl service around here? <laughs> it's funny, right? Here he is on the couch now, or the sofa, some people say, or the lounge chair. Ahem! Who's he talking to? Who's he talking to? Are you talking to the other cat in the house? You're in my spot! That's where I curl up, sometimes. And look, the cat's moved, but he's followed. Now you're in my other spot! Oh, this poor cat's in for a tough life. Now you're in my third spot! I think that cat might be my greatest enemy in the entire house. Oof. And off he goes, exploring around the house. Mm. My pores are dirty. I guess it's my time, or I should say, I guess it's time for my 17th bath of the week. A little privacy, please! <laughs> it's so funny, right? Oh my on this, I look at the poor look on the cat's face. All I did was come to say hello. A little privacy, please! Says the big cat. <laughs> Let's turn another page. Hey! Look! An empty box. Now what? There's a noise. Hang on, not yet. My eyelids are getting heavy. Heavier. Heaviest. And then he look, he gets so tired, he falls down. Thump. But then... Vroom! Oh, seriously, what's that noise? A vacuum. And that noise. 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 And that noise! And that noise! That noise! That noise! And that noise! And that noise! Oh! The cat can hear every little sound, and every little sound makes an alert. A monster! Ah! A monster! A monster! It's a monster, I say! Run for your lives! He runs. It's not a monster, right? It's a vacuum, right? <laughs> yeah, it's a vacuum. You got it. I told you I heard something. Stay away, monster! You do not want to mess with these claws! You do not want to bear the brunt of these teeth! Oh, no, you don't! <laughs> What's the cat going to do next? <gasps> now what? Hmm. Oh. I guess I'll bat this piece of foil around. Bat. 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 That's three bats. So, what's the point? Hey, the monster's gone. I gotta get out of this house. Monster's gone. I think that monster's gone for now. I need to know what's going on in every room of this place. He looks around the corner. What's he gonna see? <gasps> I want to eat that plant. I want to chomp on that book. I want to scratch the couch, uh, but I already tore the material off both arms. I want to rip the curtain. But hey, that's just me. But the cat is very smart, not him, right? Mm -hmm. He's going over to the curtain now, is he? Oh, hang on. 
You're in my spot again. Oh dear. You're in my other spot again. You're in my third spot again. <laughs> this poor cat is in for a very tough time. Apologies, everyone listening to this story for the bumpy table we're on, but hey, it, I think it adds a certain element of nervousness to the whole thing, don't you? Why am I even standing here? Like, this is pretty random even for me. He's sniffing this. Wait, why did I sniff, just sniff that catnip toy? Sheesh, I'll be awake all night. Goodness gracious. Why can't I stop smelling this shoe? I have to stop. Still, it's intriguing. What is it about this shoe? <laughs> is this what the outside smells like? Things would be different if I knew how to open a door. I haven't been outside in eight years. I'm trapped in this house all the time. I just go from room to room with nothing to do. Hey, who's that at looking through the window? A squirrel. Whoa, could be a squirrel, you're right. Let's have a little look. This is the squirrel talking now. You cat, hello? I spy you through this window. I confess that I've watched you mope around your house for months. Now listen to me, cat. Somebody feeds you, somebody changes your litter box, somebody gives you water, somebody brushes you and keeps you warm and even hands you treats. Treats, I say! Meanwhile, I scurry around outside hiding nuts that I'll never locate, evading predators and listening to multiply. Things are difficult out here, cat. I don't have much. My branch have caused this tree, although it's shared with roommates. A few nuts I've kept, a piece of ribbon, which I'm saving for some reason, a button. And that's about it. Sure, you may be housebound and you may find reasons to gripe. I know this is a long page, but bear with me about your current living situation. But look at me, kitty. You think it's so great outside? Honestly, what I wouldn't give just for a touch of boredom from time to time. Yes, I would give my right paw to trade places with you for a day. So quit saying, poor me, and start embracing the life you have. Everything else will fall into place after that. Think about it. Okay, let's turn the page. That was a long page, but you stay with it. Guess what's going to happen next? How could I eat this very talkative squirrel? Hmm. He's lucky there's this window screen separating us. I know, things would be different if I knew how to open window screens. A few extra words there, but that's a bonus. Oh, yeah, how mad. I have nothing to do when I'm vaguely hungry. Maybe I'll meow for a while. Let's see how this plays out. Yo, those meows were meant I meant I wanted wet food, not dry food. Wet food, not dry food. Wet food. That's the dry. You get it? Not dry food. Wet food. That's the wet food. Right? That's the dry food. This is wet. This is all dry food. It's all dry food. Let's try this again. Into infinity until it never stops. Yes, my whole day has led me to this wet food. This is a highlight for sure, and that's quite a lot. Says quite a lot about my day. Yeah, but hang on a second, you're leaping ahead of the story. I guess it's okay in here sometimes. Munch, munch, munch. Yum. More. That's not bad at all. More. Hang on, let's read the page. What does it say? I already want some more. You were right, young James, who's my helping, helping reader today. Meow. Anyone? Meow. Maybe, maybe the small cat is in there. No, oh, possible. Yes. Who knows where the small cat's gone now? Hmm. Back into the cardboard box. Now what? <laughs> Looking outside again. Now what? <laughs> oh dear. You're in my spot. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> that poor little cat. Oh man. Oh man. When's that sun been coming back? <laughs> the end.
Bye, everyone. And that was, of course, one of our favorite books of all time. Come!